Well, you guys, I never thought this would be ever even happening again, but I'm in Anime Dimensions. I know, it's a big shock because, you know, the last time I made a video on this game was so long ago. But I decided to do another, a few showcase and one versus videos for today because I'm going to soon go back to being very busy. So, let's get started with the video. So, here's the showcase. First move is the Paradise Slicer. A combo of one win with my critical, 1.4 million. A lot of people probably do more than that because I have not touched this game in months and months. Paradise Waterfall. A combo of 14. So then this would basically do, let's see. And then with the critical, it does nearly 500k with 14. That's like a very lot. A couple million, you guys. Like these new characters are beyond crazy damage. Paradise Vortex. Which is basically a vortex and then you go running around with a combo of about 20. It's decent, I guess. I think that was around, I have no idea, maybe 3 million damage for me. We're looking at AoE. AoE, very good. And now we have Nitoriu, which is two sword. Basically, it's the same thing. If you guys see, it does about... Wow, okay. Um, that's something. Let me use this again, then we'll see. So then after you have basically gigantic slashes. That's pretty good, but let me try to see this again. So 93 times a 60. So for me, this does over like nearly 6 million. But it does about like 5 something, 5.5 million. For me though, a lot of other people can do way more than that. So this is pretty much Odin. He has, it's kind of like the same thing, but I do, I am kind of disappointed in this move. Like, see you guys, this move is like, almost everyone can have this move. Like, this is pretty good. You know, the AoE of the second move, I believe, is better. Now, let's look at the cooldowns on these things. Now, if Paradise Slicer is 6, that is 11. Now, Paradise Vortex, I'm going to wait for that one real quick. So, the cooldown appears to be about 14. Which, of course, the fourth move is like almost every other one. Some of them have lowers, but I don't need to showcase that one. But overall, though, on the AoE, he is pretty decent on AoE. But mostly all the moves kind of look the same, you know, like with the rounded slashes. I guess we don't have much more intel on Odin. Well, you guys, this is Odin. I'm going to do another one right after this one. And then I'm going to give you guys some, you know, some ideas on who you should buy. Odin or Kaido. That one is going to be coming up soon. But next up, we're going to do the Kaido Showcase, so make sure to go watch the next video coming up really soon. I'll see you guys in the next video.